one of the issues I, uh, I haven't had a chance to speak about, at least in video for, uh, was the background to Novell uh, from my personal perspective. Uh, so I thought I'd do a uh, few videos, uh, no attempt at doing second takes at that, and basically walk through uh, several things. So the first thing is my history with Novell, uh, especially when it comes to Novell as a uh, GNU slash Linux distribution distributor uh, when it comes to SUSE. So I've, I've, I've basically used SUSE even before uh, Novell was part of the company's uh, uh, story. So uh, then I, I like to speak about the deal. So that's basically the turning point from my personal perspective. Uh, and then it would be quite reasonable to go on and speak about the end of Novell. So I am currently in a very Discomfort, well, discomforting situation in the sense that I, I might have to uh, stop looking at Novell News because it really has become quite a, a waste of time now. If I look at news about Novell as a company, not that sh well, there is Attachmate, but Attachmate has got its own product, its own people, and its own culture and like, obligations to companies, I, I guess even to Microsoft, because it is a gold, uh, a gold certified partner of, of Microsoft. Uh, so, uh, I'm really at the stage where I feel Novell is basically dead as a company and then just a lesson in history. Uh, so it's a reasonable time for me to, to do some commentary about it. Uh, so let me just end this video. In the next one I'll try and explain how I came to know Novell in the first place and stuff like that.